The Bears have made the playoffs. I'm very conflicted after today. The Bears game was not as much of a blowout as the score would suggest. Through most of the game, it was a one possession game. They started off really well and they had that one really long drive with a couple fourth down conversions that frankly they should have just kicked a field goal with. But if they converted that for a first down and scored a touchdown, then the Bears would have taken the lead. But the defense did not show up today. The offense stalled out a couple times, but Pagano had some terrible play calls. I remember early in the game him not putting anybody on Devontae Adams. And then he had one of the most boneheaded calls where he put Danny Trevathan on man coverage versus MVS. You know, Danny Trevathan, a guy who's lost his speed versus one of the fastest receivers in the NFL. I would be shocked if Pagano has a job by next season. I also think that Trubisky proved today that he's clearly not the guy in Chicago. I think the Bears should consider trading for a QB or trying to find one late in the draft. I just don't see him being the quarterback of the future for us. But yeah, John Wolford got us the playoff spot. Rams went against half Kyler Murray, half Straveler. Kyler Murray got hurt and then he came back in, didn't really do much. But yeah, we have to give a thank you to the Rams for getting us into the playoffs. Right now, I'm kind of half optimistic, half pessimistic. Our wildcard matchup will be against the Saints, a team that we nearly beat with Nick Foles. But that Saints team that we played earlier in the season is not really the same team. And it looks like Alvin Kamara will be eligible because our game will be at Sunday, 4.30. But hey, we went on a six-game losing streak, and Matt Nagy was able to will his guys into a playoff spot. And I'm just happy that the Bears are even going to be able to contend for the playoffs. So yeah, hopefully Bears get their first playoff win in 10 years. Hopefully, see you guys next week.